The defense pushed ahead presenting its case in the federal bribery and corruption trial of New Jersey senior U.S. Senator Bob Menendez. Cameras are not allowed in federal courtrooms, but chief political correspondent Michael Aaron was inside and is here with details. Michael? Mary Alice, one of the main allegations against Senator Menendez is that he went to bat for his friend Salomon Melgan over a port security contract in the Dominican Republic. Melgan bought into a company that had a contract to screen all cargo there, but the U.S. government was planning to send surplus screening equipment to the DR government. That would have cut out Melgan and cost him millions. In 2013, the New York Times reported Menendez discouraged giving port security equipment to the Dominicans. Prosecutors say he did it in return for bribes. The defense today called William Brownfield to the stand. He was Assistant Secretary of State for International Narcotics and met with Menendez several times. The meetings, said Brownfield, involved drug smuggling through the DR. Was Senator Menendez interested in Caribbean security issues, asked defense attorney Abby Lowell. Brownfield replied, he was one of the top two in the Senate interested in the region. The Melgan contract dispute was not mentioned in Brownfield's testimony, but perhaps the prosecution will bring it up tomorrow on cross-examination. Four other witnesses testified for the defense today. Autism activist Kerry Magro called Menendez a champion. He has been one of the most honest and trustworthy people I've ever met in my life, Magro said. Kerry Talbot was Menendez's immigration expert for years. She testified there was no coordinated effort on behalf of Melgan, despite what the New York Times reported. Curlin Espinal is Menendez's director of immigration services. She testified Menendez has helped thousands of people get visas, not just the three Melgan girlfriends the prosecution focused on. And Raul Alarcon, the president of Spanish Broadcasting System, testified he gave $100,000 to a Democratic PAC to help Menendez get reelected in 2012. Melgan gave $600,000 to the same PAC. Did anyone condition that payment on a bribe, Lowell asked Alarcon? Absolutely not, said the witness. This is the second week of defense testimony. During legal skirmishing between the sides, Judge William Wall shot out, when you get to Philadelphia, you can bring that up. Philadelphia is where the federal appeals, appeals court sits. It was a signal the judge expects an appeal regardless of who wins at trial. Mary Alice. 